Good evening, welcome to Ross Tax. I'm Zaka Jacob. We're starting off with some breaking news. It's an exclusive news break. National Security Advisor Ajit Doval is right now in Russia. He's met with his counterpart Nikolai Patrushev. Uh, a meeting with other leaders or with Vladimir Putin, the Russian president, is subject to further developments in Moscow. Uh, his visit is crucial right now because, remember, this war is now dragging into its seventh month. Uh, and clearly, there is some degree of anticipation and hope, particularly in Western European countries like France and Germany, who are hoping that India will lean on Russia using its influence. Remember, India has one, been one of the few countries, one of the few big powers in the world, which is not joined in the sanctions against Russia, which was inspired by the West, by the US and its NATO partners in Europe. India has not voted against Russia at the United Nations Security Council or in the General Assembly. So there is an expectation from countries in Western Europe to use India to help lean on Russia to look at some kind of a ceasefire. The question is, will the Ukrainian side agree to a ceasefire? Will the Russian side agree to a ceasefire? Also, uh, India does have legitimate queries and concerns about two things. One, defense supplies and spare parts, uh, as well as, of course, uh, the flow of uh, oil. India, of course, imports a large amount of its oil and gas uh, and uh, the Russian contribution in India's imports has gone up in the last six months. Abhishek Jha tracks the MEA for us. Abhishek, uh, what more details do we have about uh, what else was discussed when uh, NSA Doval met his Russian counterpart, uh, Nikolai Patrushev? Uh, so, Zaka, clearly India and Russia are trying to deepen their bilateral ties and also they are trying to understand each other's point of view. Uh, in the wake of Russia-Ukraine conflict, we have seen in the last six months, uh, there has been a clear division in the global uh, space, if we say one is uh, led by US and Western bloc, another is led by, uh, literally by Russia and the uh, countries which have not sided with uh, US and Europe. Indian uh, uh, external affairs minister has recently made remarks quite a few times that India will have to also look for its own interests while uh, maintaining that the war should uh, see uh, happening in Ukraine and, uh, Ukraine and uh, there should be all sort of humanitarian aid and assistance to the people who are being affected with this conflict. But at the same time, India cannot ignore its 1.3 billion population and their own energy security interests. So this is why this whole theory of India buying Russian oil and thus uh, keeping Russia afloat to fight Ukraine is something that he has tried to puncture in the past also and uh, even uh, recently also. Ajit Doval meeting Russian counterpart is clearly a, a time when uh, both countries will try to understand each other's point of view on regional and global issue. Regional issue is especially important in the wake of Afghanistan. Uh, ever since the fall of Afghanistan to in the hands of Taliban, uh, there has been security threat emanating from that soil. Uh, we know uh, recently Ayman al Zawahari al Qaeda chief was killed in Afghanistan. So, uh, what sort of security concerns are there, and how both these countries can collaborate and talk further on this issue? This this is also one of the important areas uh, where both these uh, countries are trying to engage. Uh, Ajit Doval happens to be the only second high-level cabinet rank uh, uh, government official who has visited Russia ever since the Ukrainian war or Russia-Ukraine conflict has started. And this clearly shows the kind of, uh, you know, engagement Russia wants with India. And uh, right. also we have seen uh, Indian Prime Minister Modi and uh, having talked with, on telephone with uh, his French counterpart where both also discussed uh, Russia-Ukraine conflict. They also discussed global supply chain and food security. So clearly, India is in a position where uh, both sides of the faction uh, wants to uh, be engaged with India, and they also clearly uh, try to understand the Indian point of interest. Uh, and probably uh, this visit of Doval to Russia is uh, in uh, one step in that direction. All right, Abhishek Jha, we'll leave it at that uh, for the moment. Abhishek, there reporting for us on this visit of our National Security Advisor Ajit Doval uh, to. Russia. Meanwhile,